We had such big plans. Chloe would get a job at the perfume counter in Debenhams and I'd get a job in the cafe on the top floor. Or failing that, Woolworths. We'd save up and then rent a flat. We'd spend all our money on skirts and beads and blue bottles of alcohol in nightclubs. We were going to eat Arctic Roll whenever we felt like it and watch Leonardo DiCaprio in Titanic and Romeo and Juliet every night. But I never got a job at a cafe and I never tried Woolworths. And Chloe never made it to the perfume counter. Instead, she'll always be 14, smelling of sweat and hairspray and cigarettes, talking about her T-zone or some handbag. Carl ruined everything. Driving us up Avenham in his horrible car, leaving me to stand guard while him and Chloe did things. It's his fault she's dead, not mine.